Continuing the build of our two seven and a half inch gauge uh, cabooses. And we finished, uh, yesterday we finished uh, the, the, the frame for the roof assembly and now we're uh, doing the, uh, the, the roof assembly, uh, the frame for the center couple of caboose. And I've just gone ahead and got the, the two long pieces um, measured and we need to notch them out um, for the coppola to, to be there. And we'll do that. And I want to go ahead and mark uh, which ones are the, this is the front here. We'll do front. And I can do this uh, one and two. This here's the back and back. And here we have one and two. And this here is going to be the front and back. And front is that way and front is that way. Okay. Marking where we need to notch this out. And this one here is about nine and an eighth. We have all the pieces, they... Okay, we have all the pieces. They all uh, fit nicely. We have marked them all. So now what I want to do is uh, notch out these two boards and make sure they fit in there nicely. And then we'll come along and cut this. Well, we'll, uh, we'll go ahead and cut this off and glue and nail the frame together. notches right here and there for the uh, coppola to sit into. Make sure they line up nicely. And they do. We're going to go ahead and glue and uh, nail this frame together. Okay, we have this part of the frame done. Uh, we'll cut this off and then we'll put these final um, cross beams on once we have the coppola cut off. right where we want it to go. So we will.
pretty good. Now, I need to take these clamps off. Take our guide off, and we'll flip the car around. Guide back on. Okay. And we'll get this one cut. Here comes the moment of truth. Let's see if our, let's see, I think we got the, front, look at that, that fits in there nicely, woohoo, just the way it's supposed to, and we got the back, front, all right. Okay. That's in there nicely. Now I, I'm clamping this frame in place so we know right where we want it to be. And then this is the older kit that we got out of the estate sale and so the wood's a little bit warped but I'll clamp this in tight nice okay that's where we want that um, drawing some lines where I know where to put the glue and we should be able to glue this in place. I decided I'm going to go ahead and use the lo longer pins on, on this. Um, they will come all the way through just a little bit. That's okay, then I'll just use the uh, little grinder and cut them off. Um, the other ones I have are a little bit too short, so Be right back, I need our wax paper. All right, well, we are back, and what we've done is on this um, roof here, we finished up the we, we finished up this frame. We glued and nailed the, um, the cupola um, structure to the frame, and then we went ahead and put in the quarter inch by uh, one inch um, little um, 
collar around the inside of the locomotive, or excuse me, of the caboose here, and glued and nailed that, and that goes ahead and holds um, this roof from going down uh, too far. So it sets in there perfectly. So it's nice and, um, so the angle is from here is even with the edge here. And then what I've done is, instead of having two separate pieces of plywood for the roof, we went ahead and um, just went and got some quarter inch plywood and cut that so that it fits nicely right here. Because I wanted to have this little roof section across here so that uh, when I put the trim across down here, you won't see that, um, that joint uh, from where the roof lifts up. And we'll do the same thing on this side. So what I'm gonna do now is I have um, went ahead and marked where um, on the roof here where we want the nails to go and we'll put some glue on here and then we'll pin this down and we'll do the other side. All right, we'll go ahead and uh, pin this one down. Make sure we got a bunch. Yep. All right, well, we got this all dialed in. We'll let this set up overnight. And then uh, I cut some um, one inch by, oh, uh, by about a quarter inch strips. And this will be that trim piece that will go basically right along here. And we'll put a little notch on each end. And that will um, finish off the trim on our, um, on our caboose. Uh, the first roof and then we'll figure out how to do the uh, roof on the cupolas next. All right. Well, I'm Holly McLean for Train Lee TV and thank you so much for watching. Please like us on Facebook and please follow us and subscribe to our channel on YouTube. That helps us out a lot and enables us to go ahead and let people know that they're watching, liking what we're doing and we'll continue to do more of these videos. Once again, I'm Holly McLean and thanks again for watching.